This arithmetic reasoning practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCat says, Anderson purchased a shirt for $18.90. If this includes 5% sales tax, what was the actual price of the shirt? So in other words, we want to know the price of the shirt that doesn't include sales tax. So in other words, we have to know this. The total price of the shirt is going to be equal to the original price of the shirt plus the original price times the tax amount. The total price is right here. It's going to be $18.90. What was the original price of the shirt? That's unknown. So I'm going to let the original price of the shirt be represented with the letter variable X. So this becomes X plus, again, this right here is unknown. So let's call it X. What is the tax amount? It's right here. It's 5%, which we're going to express in decimal form as 0.05. So this becomes X times 0.05. All right, let's go ahead and do this the old fashioned way here. Again, imagine there's a one in front of this X. This becomes 1890 equals 1x plus 0.05x. What is 1x plus 0.05x? Well, that's going to become 1.05x. Now, all we have to do is solve this equation for x, and we'll have our answer. And I know many of you could have jumped right to this step right here. So again, I just did this part right here to show you the logic behind this problem, but many of you could have jumped right to this part right here. That said, we're going to be solving this equation for x now, so we're going to divide both sides of the equation by 1.05 to get x by itself. This crosses out, leaving us with x over here, and I'm going to read this as long division, notably as 1890 divided by 1.05. I can't do long division with the decimal outside the division bracket, which it is right here in 1.05, so I'm going to shift it two times to the right to make it 105. And at the same time, I'm going to take the decimal in 1890 and shift it two times to the right as well to make it uh, 1890. All right, so now we can do this long division. How many times does 105 go into 189 without going over? It's going to be one time. 105 times 1 is 105. Let's do the subtraction. 9 minus 5 is 4. 8 minus nothing is 8. 1 minus 1 is nothing. Now we got to drop down this 0. How many times does... 105 going to 840 without going over. You should be able to see this mentally. 100 times 8 would be 800. 5 times 8 would be 40. So we know this is going to be 8. 105 times 8 is going to be 840 with no remainder. So X is 18. Again, X refers to the original price of the shirt, not including sales tax. And we could see that that is going to be B, $18.